weather is hot, then this weekend could be considered sweltering. With potentially record-breaking heat on the way, cities and towns across Connecticut are offering families a way to beat the heat a little early this year. What are your plans to beat the heat? I'm personally going golfing. We are heading out to the Cape where it's going to be a little bit cooler. With potentially record-breaking temps on the way, West Hartford is taking action. We've been monitoring the weather forecast and decided to expedite the opening of our splash pads. The reaction from families? Oh, it's a week early? Oh, nice. Heck yeah. And they aren't the only community offering some early season relief. We're making sure our recreation centers will be open tomorrow. They will be open with their indoor pools up and running. But outdoor pools will have to wait a little longer, typically Memorial Day weekend. Until then, the state parks can provide a cool down, 22 designated swimming areas, but caution. Lifeguards are not at their stations yet, so um, we encourage parents to really watch their children. And remember that hot air temperature doesn't mean warm water temperature. Right now, our water temperatures are in the mid to upper 50s, and that's still pretty cold. And while the weather heats up, <laughs> stores are stocking up. This is unexpected for, you know, New England to have a 90 degrees in this early in May. Larson's Ace Hardware is seeing air conditioners, grills, pools, and other items fly off the shelves just as fast as they can stock them. All up to our warehouse in uh, uh, New York to have the properly stocked. Um, yes, are we going to have some delays and sometimes? Yes. And remember, you don't need to be a kid to cool off. Remember these West Hartford splash pads whoo, open at 10 a.m. Saturday. And if you need tips on how to stay safe in the heat, be sure to log on to our website, fox61.com. For the Fox 61 News in West Hartford, I'm Matt Karen.